Warning, this video may contain spoilers for the TV show or movie that we discuss in this video. If you have not yet watched the TV show or movie that this video is about, please come back to the video at a later time after you have watched the content that was discussed. You have been warned. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? This is Robin Novacast back with some more of Stranger Things, or Let's Watch Stranger Things. This is Season 2, Episode 8, and this one starts where the number, Episode 6, dropped off, where the Demigorgons arrive at Hawkins' lab and proceed to kill everyone. No joke. They pretty much kill everybody, except for our main cast, but, you know, they were able to get out with one sacrifice, which being Bob, which is unfortunate. Um, following up with that, um, so, uh, some of the other groups, Nancy, Jonathan, um, Steve, with Dustin, Lucas, and Max, uh, show up at the same time at Hawkins. And as everybody's being evacuated, they all just kind of book it out of there. Um, and I gotta say, like, with Bob's death, that was probably probably one of the saddest moments in this in this show so far. One of them, anyway. Um, so they get to the buyer's house. And... With Will um, asleep, they try to figure out what they need to do. And I love that they gave this one moment to acknowledge Bob um, and kind of mention that, you know, his death won't be in vain, we'll kill this thing. Sure enough, they find out, or at least use an analogy from D&D &D again, which I really love, um, to call this thing the Mind Flare, the, the thing that's controlling everything, the vines, the upside down, the demi-dogs, etc. So at this point, they need to figure out what they need to do. So what they do is they take the shack from uh, outside the buyer's uh, house, redecorate it, tie Will up inside, and then proceed to try and question him. But the only problem is they don't know whether it's Will they're talking to or if it's the Mind Flare. But sure enough, with them, you know, Reminiscing on some of the memories with Will, um, he does start talking, though not with his mouth, no. He starts using Morse code, and he's able to tell them, with a little bit more prodding, that he needs, or at least they, need to close the gate. And after that, <laughs> Um, an unfortunate thing happens where the phone rings and Will finds out where they are. And as I will say, and there's this cool moment where they're all preparing for battle, like as if, you know, this is their last stand. And then all of a sudden you see 11, like you hear, actually it starts off with like them hearing noises in the background. And then, all of a sudden, like, nothing. In fact, one demigod crashes through the window. Next thing you know, the door opens by itself, and it's 11. And everybody is kind of... Actually, I don't know what would be the right reaction for that, but, yeah. Now, there was one moment that was really interesting um, with this episode. And that's the interaction with uh, Bill, or Billy, with his, uh, his father. Which, I'm kind of curious on this, this dad's background, because he really puts fear in this dude. And it would kind of explain why he's the way he is, in a sense. Um, that maybe this dad is abusive, he doesn't know how to, treat, how to 
deal with his son. He doesn't know anything at all. Who knows? But either way, it was a really interesting, interesting experience. As as for the rest of this episode, um, I enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun to watch. Um, R.I.P. Uh, R.I.P. Bob. R.I.P. Okay, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys for watching. Truly appreciate it. If you have anything you'd like to add to the conversation, leave your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you want to follow us on social media, links are in the description. If you guys want to follow us with more gaming content, Magi, Aiden, and MJ do gaming content on Twitch and YouTube. If you guys want to watch any nature walks, Sage does that. It's a ton of fun to watch. If you guys want to watch some of the gaming content or let's watch or review videos that I've been doing where I either will do let's plays or talk about a movie or TV show that I'm watching, then go check those out. Usually I upload or premiere the videos around midnight, 6 a.m. and noon Pacific time. Once again, that is midnight, 6 a.m. and noon Pacific time. And on Sundays, usually around 6 p.m., we do our podcast. With that being said, this is Rob of Novacast signing off. Have a good one and take care. Peace.